Yep, 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 we do this for the people, man. We hit all the hard-hitting topics that the streets need to hear, man. The orange bumps, the sleazeball central, the boot mitt, knee bleach and serum, taking it too far with a hotel towel, and of course, man, why my man driving sideways with it? <laughs> Listen, man, y'all know what we need y'all to do, man. Jump over there down in the, in the Yamits, man. Get on them keyboards, man, like Alicia would. Yeah. Hit the clickety-clack on the rating system, man. Five stars, we love it. Yeah. Leave a good review. Enjoy this episode, man. Come on, man. Got that comment right now while it's going to the next part. Cool. Hey, Amen. Bruh, bruh, bruh. The kneecaps are out, man. Yeah. Bruh, bruh, bruh. <laughs> Life. Bruh. Oh yeah. That's right. Bruh, bruh. Oh, yeah. Yeah. How much my knees are showing? Not knees. Light, light, light. Maybe like a little bit. There's no knee in the frames? Just a little bit of knee. I'd rather my knee in the frame. The knee is in the frame. Bruh, bruh. <laughs> Check out my knee, man. You got a face on your knee? Y'all got faces on your knees? Yeah, I got a knee uh, face. Let me look. I don't think I got a knee face, bruh. Nah, I ain't got no knee face. My shit is straight, man. Yeah, no, I just see a kneecap. It's the only cap in me, bro. I'm going to tell Talk you, I, 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 put, come up here and get one of these. I put, uh, what is it, glycolic acid on my kneecaps. And glycolic my acid? Yeah, and then just like smooth them out. Like what do you shit. put on there? Glycolic acid. What's that what about? What is that about? Um, You could get it at the ordinary or wherever. What is it? It's just an acid. It's a serum for your face. But, but you, you could put it on your whole body. What does it do? It like kind of lightly exfoliates. Nice. So you want you're bleaching your knees? I ain't say that. My knees are still dark. <laughs> so what do you mean lightly exfoliates? <laughs> like not harshly exfoliates, <laughs> yeah, like motherfucker. A, <laughs> what is what, what do you no nah, really, nah, what do you mean? What are you doing to your why are you exfoliating your because knees? Because you are your knees like are they rough? Yeah, they're roughed up. Yeah. Okay then. You know, Mine aren't. Things. Your knee wait. All right. Yeah. Oh, okay, I get it. I get it. I get that's it. it. If you yeah. want to be soft, that's fine. Yeah, no, 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 no. So it's a new ointment, man. A new cream, a new nah, serum, for sure. Man. I need all the essentials. Like, what do I need in my cabinet to be good for life? Fuck, man. We don't got enough time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Is glycuric acid on there? <laughs> I, I never heard of it. I don't think you need. I don't think you need that one. But it's nice. Who told you about it? Who t who looked at your kneecaps and said, "Bro, y'all." You Nobody. Knew, it's just yeah, my girl. Know. It's just you know you act when you see her doing shit. It's like, why are you doing that? What does it What's do? That? Right. Yeah, and yeah. then you feel what it do, and you like. Bro, I've been noticing it does that. They got a product for everything, man. Yeah. Everything. Every part of the body. Yeah, man. So, the, every area. No, yeah. It's his own cream. You try the cocoa butter. You ever do that? The whip oh, cocoa man. butter. Oh yeah, yeah. Like the like, raw. Like, shit. You could eat yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bro, I can eat it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You could, bro. That shit just be having me slimy. You yeah. at the event. Mm -hmm. You ever use coconut oil for cooking <laughs> and on your body? Yeah, really yeah, do. yeah, for sure. I go Guys, to the kitchen and lather yeah, up. That's, that's the trippiest <laughs> thing for me ever. I swear to God, bro. I was just yeah. like, yo, I needed some oil because I, I think my skin was dry. Mm -hmm. um, or it may have been like a sunburn. And went to the kitchen, fucking scooped the oil, put it on my back. And I said, hey, hold on. That's not aloe? No, it was cooking. It was coconut oil. Wait, somebody nice. did that or you did that? Yeah. Somebody gave oh, it to me. Oh, they're like, oh, like, try this. me on coconut yeah. oil, but cooking with it. I was and like, how did you feel like the first time? I felt like a coconut. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. I K felt then. like a coconut, bro. Okay, then. Okay, then. I just felt like something was off about it, mm -hmm. for real. You haven't done it since? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I used to like, I used to do it. Like, I used to go through cans. I'm not going to lie. Cans of the cocoa? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I used to buy a cocoa just for my body. And it was cheap, too. <laughs> like, it was cheap at the grocery store. It probably still is, but... Like mm. the white joint, right? Like the yeah, like the yeah, and then it get too hot in your room, it literally melt. Yeah, to water. Yeah, it's just water. You're like, yeah, oh, this is better. This is hot wax. <laughs> yeah. yeah, no, 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 no. I don't, I don't really use it no more. I use it on tattoos. Remember I, I use tattoo. Aquaphor. Mm. I don't do anything else. Yeah, mm. once I found out about Aquaphor, it's okay, nice. Yeah, that's mm. a good. Ointment. That's a one stop shop. Yeah, it really is. That's a multi purpose one stop shop ointment. Still, yeah. bro, you put on your lid real quick yeah. and start. The whole face, yeah, yeah, yeah. Whenever oh. I have too much, that's why I'll put, I'll put aqua on my knees. Mm. But I'm kind of, I'm kind of shocked. I don't got rough knees, bro. 
That's a good. I only like that's how I was surprised. Like, yeah, I mean, because some nah. niggas' knees got wear and tear for sure. So that's yeah. why I thought you meant you had to yeah. lighten up your knees, no, which no, is no, why no, I thought no. it was like a light bleach. No, it's just you know if you was like if you was a scrappy kid and shit. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean, you was fucking in the dirt and shit. Yeah, yeah. Quick nah, clean up. I got, yeah, I got these dark circles around my eyes. So I seen a lot of like uh, I was trying to find some. Uh, some help, <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> and I went to Sharper's Drug Man, and they're talking about like, oh, some some serum being like a bleach. I was like, bro, wait, you can just say it out loud these days? Oh, for sure. I didn't, I didn't know, I didn't yeah. know that world existed because yeah, no, obviously, from eye bleach. Car, it's like skin bleach, but it's mm. like just for the your eyes, or saying just yeah. for that area, oh, just to lighten up the dark spot. Okay, which yeah. is why I thought you're like bleaching your knees. I'm like, I didn't know because no, no, it was no, no, just no, so no. fucking. Right, right. <laughs> you, I thought niggas bleaching their knees nah, out there. For sure, I heard you. Heard you. Um, but I'm surprised when they they saw that to me. I thought it was like Jamaica. Was, I don't even know if it was frowned upon. What was the what was the whole thing? Well, it's, bleaching. Was Bro, bleaching. It's, it's pretty like it's not frowned upon. It's out there. Bro, I, I see know. like TikTok pages of like dudes in Jamaica like. Mm-hmm. It's like having like fresh kicks and shit. Like, mm-hmm. um, have the fresh bleach fun. But there's a yeah. problem. Like, Cartel was doing it. Yeah. Is what I'm saying. Yeah, I just can't. Mm-hmm. I can't remember what it was. I was like too young, not really paying attention it was, to that shit. It was but, a like, cream. Yeah, it was like people were being so, like called out, called out for bleaching. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Like, look at these two pigs. You see their knuckles in their. Yeah, yeah. they got the dark knuckles. Yeah, and you can't really get it in the fucking UV. Yeah, you can't yeah. get it in the UV. Me so. Yeah. Yeah. Tight shit. Yeah. But yeah, I didn't do it. Still, I just stuck to cucumbers. Nothing works. Yeah, <laughs> you should try that. The I trust skincare, man. I do. You gotta do. go North Korean. I mean, South Korean. The streets. Yeah, the Korean. Yeah, they got it. They got it. They got the skin stuff. Yeah, yeah. It's it's just be yeah. too. It'd be a little bit more, and it'd be kind of like difficult to get. For me, mm-hmm. I like to find. I like to find the shit that I can find very easily. Yeah. Mm-hmm. In the chain stores, you know what I'm saying? You might get a one, two that's like obscure, but maybe it lasts way longer yeah, than other yeah. joints. But Sometimes yeah. you find a thing, man, that yeah. just works with your body. For right sure. Go, I got to go on a quest for this one. Got to trust the Zon, bro, because. The Amazon, Jeff yeah. and Because mm-hmm. you, you, we have shit here, but it's like, yeah, I don't know. I'm afraid to test products with products from here. But if, when I'm in Japan, I'll test some shit on my skin. Mm-hmm. When I'm in Jamaica, I'll be like, man, I can trust this a little bit. Yeah. Like, you know what I mean? Why is that, you think? I just feel like they care more about mm-hmm. like their people and their cities are clean, bro. Like, I'm looking at your gun, like, all right, bro. Y'all <laughs> How want much do you rate me, man? <laughs> <laughs> Y'all want a good face, you know? So, mm-hmm. how do you think they'd react over there in Asia if they heard a, if they smelled Razak for the first oh, time? Man, oh, you know about the Razak? Yeah, yeah, they'd yeah, yeah. Jeez, I didn't use it too much. They'd lose it, bro. But I, I've used it before. Mm-hmm. I was on that Razak. Yeah, app, hey, that was the one for you, bro. Yeah, mm-hmm. for a minute. Yeah. You start getting the compliments, like okay, I gotta keep doing this. Yeah, like, yeah. why would I stop? Yeah, <laughs> bro, it's so the strongest strong. lotion in the world. <laughs> like, bro, no, clean, no cologne is necessary. Yeah, no cologne. Like you're overdoing it if you put cologne on. Cologne, with I thought that. <laughs> what Zach a name on the too. cologne. Ray Zach. It smells Ray like Zach. the name. Yeah, it smells like the name. Ray Zach. Ray Zach. Yeah. <laughs> Ray Zach. Ray Zach. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hits you, bro. It's the most mm-hmm. potent lotion there is. Yeah. Damn. Thick as. Fuck yeah, come light. on. Like, mm-hmm. I like a yeah. thick lotion on. Oh, on. trust. Nah, bro. bro I need no. to be rubbing it in for yeah. a minute. Yeah. Let me oh, know. You guys there. like that? Because yeah, I want. Sure. Yeah, because Ray's like, you got to rub it into a point you can't even feel your skin no more, bro. Like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, oh, yeah, my feels weird now, bro. <laughs> like, I, I was rubbing for too long, man. But <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I know. Um, and you can't get it off even after a shower. Then it feels like. Oh, okay, then that's for Yeah. I've only used it in like like small increments. Like, on my hands, you know what I mean? Like, someone just had it. Oh, I'll use that. Really? Sure. No, I never had it in my house, personally, but yeah. Richie razacked his head. <laughs> Full body razack, man. You're going too far, Rich. Going too far. Bro, bro. he was Mr. Yeah. Razak. Yeah. I probably, that shit probably had his joint shining, though. Yeah. <laughs> your, hair. your head smells yeah. good, bro. That nigga, Mr. Razak, for but real. Bro, bro, if you sweat, with Razak on a bald Oops. head. Oh, yeah. And that should get into your eyes. Oh, you're bro. crying. You're, for done. Sure. <laughs> you're done. Yeah. yeah no, you're the yeah. slimiest one on the court. Yeah. Yeah, yeah no, for sure. I definitely used to. Razak saved me in some days when I didn't have deodorant, though. It was strong. Oh, bro, it was thickening up. So, yeah, I'm like, hold yeah. Uh, yeah, it was an yeah. antique print. <laughs> it was an antique, bro. I didn't put that shit on my pits, bro, and just say, yo, Zach out, bro. Right. <laughs> bro, that's the worst, man. When you catch yourself in a stinky day, like, mm-hmm. you just forget the deodorant that day. Mm-hmm. And it's like, damn. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 
Yeah. I, y'all remember the first day y'all shit was busting through the gate? No. As a kid. Or busting through the cotton, I should say. Like ever? Yeah. Mm, no. Nah. That day wasn't tragic for y'all. Mm-mm. I know one specific day, yeah. Mm. I was with Julian and his dad. We went to the gym and shit. Oh, fuck, nigga. I forgot the deodorant. Mm. We're going hard in the gym, too, mm-hmm. man. Working real good. Mm-hmm. And instead of going home, we're going to get chicken wings and shit. We're hanging out, taking the long way, looking at alligators. I'm like, bro, I reek. Yeah, yeah. yo, like yeah, you were keeping on the yeah, low. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. I was responsible with it though. Yeah. Arms down. Yeah. You know what I mean, I'm like getting mm-hmm. too active. Nah, I'm good. <laughs> All right. I'm no, done. I'm straight, bro. I'm cool. Yeah. <laughs> you go penguin mode. You go alligator mode. Yeah. Right. In the winds and shit. Yeah, that's my way, yeah. Nah, man. I remember grade. This is grade four. Wow. This is grade four. Damn, bro. I was in um, Clark, not Clark Boulevard. <laughs> Worthington. I was in Edinburgh. Edinburgh? Mm-hmm. And we just finished the gym. And I'm going to go super hard. And I was on the track team at this time. Mm. So, like, was, this was a school where you're, you're, that one teacher was, like, every teacher type shit. So, yeah. like, my track teacher is my gym teacher type shit. Yeah. So, we're doing activities, and I'm going to get active. So, yeah. running around and shit, woo de woo mm. But we're not even, like... I think this this was like a, a a snow day or a rain day, so we're just playing in the gym for our recess. So we're not yeah. changing or anything like that. Like this is just straight. Oh yeah, there's no gym clothes back then. Yeah, yeah. no, this is the just school clothes. Is your gym clothes? Yeah, yeah, it's great. Kids uh, don't sweat to win, but what? <laughs> but they don't sweat for a minute. But you never get a sweaty baby. Is that a fact? Yeah. Kids don't really be sweating like that. That makes sense to me. Bro, I don't remember yeah. sweat. I'm thinking like, about it and nah, I ain't never seen no sweaty kid. Yeah, <laughs> like, no. yeah. yeah, I don't really be seeing them sweat, but. <laughs> That's funny. Um, yeah, I don't even remember changing for gym back then. There was no. Nah. We had changed nah, rooms. Nah, like, I literally had probably done gym in my jeans. Yeah. Like, yeah. Sure. <laughs> yeah, a lot of times I play in, yeah, play yeah. in dodgeball in jeans. Yeah, 100%. Sure. Yeah. 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 I'm sending my kid to school in sweats all day. Yeah. Sweat shorts, sweatpants. Yeah. That's your uniform. I'm done. I hear that. Skims. Yeah. And anyways. Um, so you put something in their pocket, they don't come home with it. <laughs> <laughs> All of them. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah you need a zipper pocket. Yeah, my baby's sure. not holding nothing though, bro. Bro, my kid going in cargoes. Yeah. Y'all bro, ever take had- this. Zoop, house key. Mm-hmm. Tied in with the fucking clamp. Bro, you can't. Yeah. You ever had the, uh, the mittens in your jacket with the string on it? No, nah, I wasn't that type bro, of kid. Bro, I was that was type of kid, clip. bro. No, my dad I had my mittens pissed off. Mm-hmm. For real? Yeah, I kept losing mittens every time, man. He just did a little DIY in my shit. Never Damn. lost them again. Those nah, mittens reeks? No, do that. I never really wore them. They just hung oh, there, okay, bro. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> your mitts yeah. reeked? You never had a reek for a fucking stinky mitten? No, nah, my mitten. Like, after a while, it gets, like, wet, and then, let's say it's, like, a wetter day, and then you're playing mm-hmm. outside and stuff, and you go home and wash it. Next day, is fucking... Yeah, yeah. yeah. Nah. Fingers stink when you get to school. <laughs> never, <laughs> never my mitts. More so my boots, for sure. Oh, boots for, for sure. sure. No, I know they're sure. sure. Bro, bro yeah. all footwear fucking yeah. reeks. Oh, until yeah. high school. Like, you know what I <laughs> mean? Like, grade, like grade 10 shit. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Once, that's why I stepped it up. And yeah, I hated order. taking off my boot, because I had the cheap boots, bro. Mm-hmm. So I take off my Walmart boots and then the fucking <laughs> skin of the boot is still on my shoe. <laughs> like, get the fuck off. Yo, what <laughs> is that shit? It was like a felt. It was, it was like, like a, a boot. Song. Song. Like, oh, yeah, what yeah. the fuck? It was just like, it's an extra protection so your socks don't get wet. Wet. Okay. Yeah, nah. like, just, they're not like for the cheap shit. Like it's not <laughs> like when you get to the, when you buy some good boots. The slip ain't gonna come yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like it is insulated. Yeah, They're like, ah, here, nigga. Fuck, take it. Insulation. Fucking <laughs> like chips challenge, bro. Fucking fire boot, bro. That's a deep cut. So, anyways. Oh, it's like an oven mitt. <laughs> <laughs> Same deal, bro. bro. You never want to get caught stepping out with that. Like, nah, yeah, bro. Nah, you nah, crush yeah. these, you step, like, stuck to your foot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> And I used to be like fucking like maybe like grade seven, bro. Like going to people's houses in these type of boots, and I still have the fucking boot mitt. Nah, nah, I used to just leave it on. Like, right. Just on sliding. Fuck it, like, fuck it, bro. This is me, bro. It's better than my sock. Kind of sick. Yeah, I was like, yeah, my slippers are everywhere. Yeah. You go, man. I appreciate it now. Nah, I appreciate it a little more. Yeah, is that so. the girl with the boot sock? <laughs> Nah, a nigga's not gonna be booted up on my shit like that. I'll be like, take those off, bro. <laughs> Same time those are wet, leaving marks. <laughs> um, nah, so. that's hilarious. Holy <laughs> fuck. 
But yeah, bro, right. it literally used to be part of my psyche to like think about the state of my socks. Yeah, yeah like mm-hmm. how it smells and shit. Yeah, and come, yeah. I come to your house. Like, um, <laughs> I, I, gotta, I gotta do some. My dad, don't even, you uh, don't want me to do that, <laughs> bro. I, um, um, me, I used to go into other rooms, take off my socks, <laughs> like, I take off my shoes, and just stand in the room for about five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> bro, my I put on my socks already hard. Bro, that's like, as a kid, bro. So it's just like, yeah. dog, my shoes fucking stunk, bro. I Damn. know, like, fresh socks. If I put these shoes on, they're not coming out fresh. fresh like, yeah. So I promise you, bro. I used to fucking <laughs> take my shoes off, stand a little bit, just fucking wait, see how bad it is. Wait for a <laughs> a fucking dog <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, I can go I can reach I can reach yeah hello let's run, let's run. Yeah. I don't know yeah, why man. man we just didn't have a lot of socks mm-hmm. no. me neither and if we I did they all had holes in them and shit yeah. you know, like, story with my put sock, in the bro. fucking one sock between two toes trust me yeah. Yeah. we just had because this is when Walmart was approaching Canada <laughs> <laughs> This is when they started the coming out with better. the ten dollar sock packages, and Dad bought them, and like those shits were fucking like. So we should have had enough. So- yeah, yeah, no, no, no. Those, those, those are bad. Thin, those are bad. Thin, still, yeah. I didn't even have those. No, bro. The, the, the ten pack, the, the, the ten, yeah, with the pack, twenty pack. Bro, it's actually like yeah. a forty fit, like a four, like a twenty to thirty pack. Yeah, Sometimes yeah. like me. fifty socks in there, bro. Yeah. But it was ten dollars, yeah. big red sign. <laughs> mm-hmm. But the thing is, you put them on. I remember one time, I swear to God, put them on like this as a kid, and I'm pulling up. Fuck you, bro. Why you pulling up like that first? I just no, they small. <laughs> bro, we still bought them little. No. Oh, bro, they were just little. Able to, bro, you're telling me no one puts their socks on no. like this as a kid? Double okay, crib? as a kid, yeah, but. I'm a kid, bro. That's your problem, man. I went like <laughs> this. Socks. Cotton all the way up here on my knees, bro. <laughs> nah, and yeah. goes through. Like, I, they shouldn't be ripping their socks. Look how Iverson arm down yeah, on your no. Yeah. <laughs> They're like they're, disposable socks. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, really, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. You're lucky you get a two-box. They're out like of them. foot condoms, bro. Just one, one, one day wear it. Just dash when you get home, bro. Like, so they, that's the type of wetness we're dealing with. Mm-hmm. Right? So now I'm in grade four and I'm wet. My pits are wet. <laughs> yeah. Running around in my jeans. Hold on, hold on. Try that one again, please. That one's good. Different, different. My pits are wet. <laughs> my pits are wet. I'm sweating, bro. First time as a kid. And I'm a nigga, bro. So I'm a, like, I'm a bigger kid. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm packing that size on me for sure. And I remember we get upstairs now, and we're we're in a tighter space, and you have to wait to line up to get back in your classroom. Right. So my class is just is is one class, one class, right? And then lockers or coat rack, or whatever. Sorry, and a coat rack. Mm-hmm. And we're waiting outside the door, and you know how there's like a little divot in there, like it's a little groove in there, right? It goes in. So I'm waiting like right by the corner. <laughs> <laughs> Blood. <laughs> not because I smelt myself right. I'm yeah. like, yo, something was funny, man. But yeah. I, I knew what it was. Cause I'm like, I, I, some smells like Ryan here. Because <laughs> I, I smelt Ryan go through it, like where it's like, yo, this guy needs deodorant now. Like your older brother's <laughs> oh, gonna, yeah. oh yeah, yeah, they're gonna have it first. So I, I kind of knew what it was, but I just didn't know it until I found out it was me. So I'm like, fuck, let me get some space from these guys. So I'm in a corner. And now now little kids are starting to catch on, but I'm already so, I'm already the loud one in the room. Mm-hmm. So now like niggas hear me kind of being quiet. It's like, what's your mom? Oh, what's your mom? Oh, <laughs> no. Niggas are coming around me, and I I'll never forget it. Tanique, <laughs> her name is Tanique. Mm-hmm. Y'all know her, bro. You mm-hmm. know she was just just this type of girl in school, man. <laughs> Fucking comes over and says, "Damn." <laughs> <laughs> That was bad. That was bad. But I kind of got people saying, like, oh, what's she talking about? Yeah. She's just like, oh, something like something doesn't smell good. Mm-hmm. And the next nigga add on to it, Alex Chow, motherfucker, oh, man. Fuck him, man. <laughs> should have kept it to yourself, nigga. The nigga went like this over his nose. Something doesn't smell good. Took it off, came to my corner, sniffed, and said, ew. <laughs> and you know how kids get when they hit what, the ew, bro. Oh, yeah. Drag the eel, put his shirt back in there. Bro, I'm just there, just like this, looking at my old classroom. Like, yeah. bro, yeah, that's not cool, man. It is what it is, yeah. man. It is what it was. But then Mr. Guiney out of my teacher at the time told me to go to the bathroom, wet a napkin, just dab my shit off. Mm. And he told that I need to do it in that day. Wrote a note. Yeah, I wrote a note, man, and that was it. 
that was the first time I realized I'm like, yeah, I'm yeah, gonna be off. Man. I feel you. I, I remember that too. If it went yeah, I was like that, traumatic, bro. Sure. Yeah, that's fucked up, bro. It was crazy. Tanika yeah. and Alex, I will never forget. Kids like, gonna let you know, man. Kids gonna do it too. Remember that day I took my sweater off and this girl said, "Nice boobs." <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Man, <laughs> hey. My bad, my bad, bro. I ain't... Damn, that, that's that how she let me know. I'm like, all right, man. I picked bro. up the dumbbell. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You remember, remember what my story with Vanetta? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Water fight. No abs. No abs, bro. Oh, Fucking shit. throwing water everywhere. And I'm like, she got it on my Bugs Bunny drip. Aye. But I had gems on this. Right. I had gems <laughs> on my shirt. There was gems on it. There was gems. On, so you, she, everyone knows I paid about 50 up for yeah, this one. Yeah, for sure. sure. You know what I'm saying? Special like, show, yeah. This is special. Is it LT, like, L29? That may have been live. Flea market shit. Flea, flea market, market shit. So okay. it could have been. I'm freeling it out. Freeling it out. Saying, damn. <laughs> damn, girl. <laughs> you got good hands. You know what I mean? Like, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm happy I'm being included. <laughs> she says, oh, let me help you. Takes my shirt. Lifts it up. Does he even, <laughs> bro, does, 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 does he even flip? Does he even flat me off, bro? Just straight up. <laughs> oh, water, the water drips back on to my water drips into my mouth. I drink water. No, no. <laughs> no. All right, what really happened? <laughs> no, 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 that really happened. <laughs> I just would have been good. That would have, that would have been good. Thanks. But no. She oh, lifts it up because I'm already flapping. She grabs it mid flap, pulls it all the way up. Mm -hmm. Fucking look, says ill again. That's fucking funny. Says ill. I had no abs. Fuck. Drops man. the wet shirt. Oh my God. <laughs> Takes form. <laughs> Hey man, <laughs> that was great. Fucking, that was great. Seven, bro. Damn, life God. defining moments, man. Julian had just walked out to class, so he literally remembered this day leaving Mr. Morris's class right outside the lockers. Mm -hmm. And it was just so like, I'm like, bro, remember all these skinny niggas had abs and they just kept showing that dance yeah, party. This is when kids sure, are being yeah. fucking, you know what I mean? Yeah. Realizing what life is. <laughs> <laughs> abs and boobs. <laughs> <laughs> so they're fucking showing it, bro. And I was just, I was in there. I wasn't there, bro. You remember your first deal you picked up? The order? Yeah. I think, yeah, it may have been like some fucking red spice or, or uh, red speed spice. <laughs> Like, whatever that got. Oh, oh spice, 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 spice. Yeah, spice. Spice. Yeah. Speed stick. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like the Irish, the Irish joined at the speed stick. Yeah. Like classic. Yeah. It's like mm -hmm. a staple for all men. Mm -hmm. what's the, what's, I think, what's the blue, the blue joint with the gel? Sport? Yeah. Sport? That one, yeah. Sport yeah, check? Fucking, no, just no, no, sport. No, sport. <laughs> it's wearing my shoes. Speed stick, sport. Yeah, Ooh. man. It was like yeah. default for niggas. Yeah. Yeah, no, For man. sure. Y'all never, y'all ever did the axe shit? Yo. Yeah, I was an axe kid for sure. Mm. Bro, I'll take care. Like you're not sharing that school though. Let's be real. Yeah, but yeah. I'll take care of you. Yeah. I wasn't. I wasn't the. I wasn't asking for axe. I only got axe from niggas at school. Like I'll just take Give someone's me a can. Find a yeah. canister. No, I take their can. Okay, say that. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes people leave it in the school like room. I just I swap yeah. swap the can. Say this is my locker axe. Like, oh, you know okay. What I mean? So you had multiple of them. So, but it felt like in Fletcher's it was it was kind of like it was kind of like community axe. Yeah. Ain't nobody was my fault. Ain't nobody was like really tripping about the axe. Like yeah, yeah, they were sharing yeah, axe. yeah, yeah, yeah. I never I never bought axe. So I just buy straight deodorant. Mm -hmm. But the Axe served as like, yo, my gym shorts stink, sprayed them, and I can play ball in these. Mm. That's what Axe was for me. Mm. Yeah. yeah. I got this uh, like Dove spray um, deodorant. Oh, yeah, I tried that. I tried yeah. that. Yo, fuck me up, man. You trusted it? <laughs> yeah, I was, yo, got me up. <laughs> got my yeah. shit. How'd you got, reeking? Got me. Not even that. Like, it, it smelled good and shit, but it's just my my arms didn't like it. Like, oh, yeah. I was right, getting like rash. cysts and shit and bumps under. Yeah, mm -hmm. man. I, just, I had to put that one down, bro. That's what the spice mm -hmm. do to me That's, for some reason. So I, so I asked about the axe. So I'm like, I never fuck with axe really. Like, I never did a spray deodorant like that. That's yeah. my first time. So I'm like, damn. I used to think my shit was good or whatever. Yeah, no, um, man. Yeah, man. Bro, but I got so, five bones back from them. One time. Oh, yeah. From Axe? That's a right even. No, from Old, uh, Red, Old Spice. Really? Yeah, I yeah. got a bad rash. Oh, Bro, I was like hurting. It was a scab. I couldn't even lift my arm and shit. Shit. Yeah. So I them a pick. Was like, they said, sorry. That's Slid me a little uh, $5. I wish that's zeros, man. 
right, nigga. Yeah, they got, they just added some spice to you. Yeah, sure. no, I'm sure burning up. <laughs> We're two months into the new year, and one of your goals was to learn a new language. But you still can't even say hi or bye in that language yet. Not a great start, but it ain't how you start. It's how you finish with Babbel. Babbel is the language learning app of millions. Developed by over 150 language experts, Babbel gives you unlimited access to hundreds of award-winning lessons designed for all learners based on level and time commitment. Through quick 10-minute lessons, Babbel can help you speak a new language in as little as three weeks. Babbel's tips and tools are approachable, accessible, rooted in real-life situations, and delivered with conversation-based teaching, so you're ready to practice what you've learned in the real world. Don't pay hundreds of dollars for private tutors or waste hours on apps that don't really help you speak the language. Be a better you in 2024 with Babbel, the science-backed language learning app that actually works. Here's a special limited time deal for our listeners. Right now, get 50% off a one-time payment for a lifetime Babbel subscription, but only for our listeners at babbel.com slash random order. Get 50% off at babbel.com slash random order, spelled B-A-B-B-E-L dot com slash random order. Rules and restrictions may apply. I remember some cats used to like spray the axe so much on their armpits to the part where like it was white, white. foam. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like, bro, that's, that's too much. It's done, bro. It's done. That's too much, bro. That's you smell much, as good bro. as you're gonna get, bro. Yeah, that's too much, that's bro. Too much. And I feel like axe is the reason why they started doing like the whole scent thing at school. Like, you can't yeah. wear scents and shit. Yeah, yeah. yeah. too strong. Oh, yeah, because niggas was killing it, man. But I'd rather smell that than Dio. For me, yeah, because I never, I never bought, it never bothered me, but some people had like nah, things you smell BO and X. It's true. So it's like yeah. a blend you get. Blend. Yeah. I never really like it's never nice. it. Yeah. It blends. Bro, if I own a high school for breeze automatic sprays all throughout the school, th- every, 30 every 30 minutes, seconds. spray that shit, bro. Well, mm-hmm. they got the, uh, they got the little wall dispensers or you can put on the wall and it, every 30 seconds or whatever it spray out. Oh, that's what I'm talking. Yeah, I'd line that's it up that. with that. That's why I, that, I'd have that one. Yeah, okay. <laughs> every, third. every 30 seconds yeah. That shit scares me sometimes <laughs> I forget every minute oh, fuck. Oh. Y'all ever did the The, the, the wetty wetty order The fucking gel situation Yeah I prefer the gel it Comes out the spikes Yeah I prefer it The wetty wetty cold stuff Yeah I prefer it Bro you it, turn yeah. the dial And it fucking like comes spikes. out spikes yeah. Yeah. It comes out yeah, yeah. yeah. Cause yeah. then yeah. what I do I just put I just do that And then I just close my arm <laughs> <laughs> and then it's on there. It's nice in the summer. Hey, you a super nigga, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go, man. Bro, I'm fucking stuck. I fuck with it, bro. This nigga just say, hey, man. <laughs> Makes your shirt wet sometimes. Yeah. Hey, dude, you got to put it on and then... Mm-hmm. I used to put my shirt on first and then put it on. You be shaving... You, how's, you uh, shave your armpits? I trim them. That's the TikTok. <laughs> Why is that the TikTok? <laughs> Nigga, just look at I tremble. I tremble. <laughs> Niggas don't feel that enough for real. Oh my God, who cares, bro? <laughs> but we dream it like, I care for you, bro. Bro, so tell me, man. I've been being an ass, bro. <laughs> so my next question. <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm that, I'm nah, you gotta it, trim. Bro. You don't want to yeah. cut it because you might get ingrowns and shit. So you just yeah, trim real it. do. You keep it light. Yeah, you keep it light. You keep it light. You keep I it go hover. for a hover. Yes, you won't get a nah, I never got an ingrow. I just go the op- like the opposite way of like wherever the hair is at. But now nah, I, I cut. But yeah, no, I, I fuck. I hate getting grown in my armpit. I hurt. Yeah. But yeah, no. Nah. Like this all day. Yeah. Bro. Yeah, no. Nah, I, I shave them while I cut them up. Manscaped got a little guard on there. Yeah. Sure. yeah. I man, I rock with yeah. Manscaped, man. This one not even yeah. sponsored by Manscaped. Yeah. yeah they we really use that. Yeah. Bro, really. I like shaving in hotel rooms, man. I was like, man, oh. fuck it. Yeah. I still clean up and shit, but like, yeah. you know what I mean? For sure. Yeah, no, I, I do the towel situation. I mean? always feel, um, you know what I mean about this next statement. I always feel a little crazy about hotel towels. Cause I know where I'll take it with a hotel towel. Yeah, yeah. You did. Yeah, I don't yeah, know. Yeah, I know. Yeah. yeah, yeah. How dark it gets with these towels. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Cause yeah. I shave like if I'm <laughs> respectful. I want to keep it respectful. Yeah. I'm respectfully yeah. shaving, but I'm still trying. Like I'm not trying to walk on here in my hotel bathroom. So I'll yeah. put a towel down, yeah. shave myself, 
and then now there's hair on the towel. Obviously, you rinse that off and mm-hmm. wash it and it's fresh. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. I just... I think hotel, about it. You know, yeah. think about yeah. what other niggas do in town. Yeah, I'm not like, really drying my face that much. That's why I'm about with, to with say. With love? Like, like, yeah. Like, I'll dab up. Yeah. Man. I'll, you know, take, yeah. a, take a paper towel. Take yeah, a I mean, toilet paper and just fuck it. Fucking you know? my skin. Yeah. And fucking or arms. just let yeah. it dry. Just be in there. Let it dry. Literally. Yeah. <laughs> Hydration in your face, man. Yeah, I do dab. Absorb, I do yeah. dab. I do dab. But, I mean, I just, I just have to... I, it comes to a point where I'm like, all right, man, I have to, I have to trust this hotel chain. At That's why I point, care yeah. about where I stay. Yeah, yeah you got to pull it There's down. lines, bro. For yeah. sure. Yeah. There's a lot. It shit runs so deep, bro. The the day we stayed at the the five star hotel um, in Detroit. Right? In Detroit. <laughs> <laughs> in the D. In the D. <laughs> when we gave up our seats. Yeah. That was the day I said, yo, not every hotel is for me <laughs> now. For me. They're not washing these, ho- these hotel towels. Mm-hmm. I can, I would, I, I like, I couldn't even take a shower with my bare feet. <laughs> I don't think I showered, bro. <laughs> no, I went straight to sleep. You know what I'm yeah, saying? I went to bed in my coat. Yeah. yeah, I went straight like to sleep. Like I was sleeping at the airport. Yeah. You dig, so it's just like now I know, like if I'm staying somewhere, it's just it just has to be at like a certain level of yeah, like, I feel yeah, like, I gotta feel clean here. Like as mm-hmm. knowing that this is a, a communal place, people mm-hmm. come in and out. Like I gotta like, all right, what you type spraying of, this down and shit? I ain't like touching the remote and shit. Like bro, I know y'all. What type of what type of shit happened to this remote? Yeah, I can't say I get, <laughs> get that active in there, but it probably should, man. Bring a little wet wipe, a little Lysol wipe. I was thinking about packing a towel, but I feel like that's doing the extras. I would do that. I'll pack a face towel for sure. Yeah, I'll that's do a fair, face that's towel. Fair, yeah. That's fair. But you know, towel. if you get a crispy towel, they, they did it up, they <laughs> boiled this towel. That's what I'm saying. It's possible to clean a towel. Towel. Sanitize it, you know? Yeah, yeah hot they, water. So you know the right <laughs> hotel is going to do that. Oh, for that's sure. what I'm saying. Yeah, 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 I heard you. That's all I'm saying. I heard you. Bro, we was in Vegas at the Mandalay Bay, bro. <laughs> I know, I know the, the towel washing procedure, man. I couldn't say all my faith was, all right, was in, in the there. procedure, man. Yeah, no, I definitely fucking let my face absorb the water. Damn. It was a body, body dry. Yeah. I, bro, yeah. I, I promise you, bro. <laughs> I use my shirt, bro. I was about to say that. On the way out. I was about to say that. Airport shirt, yeah, I don't know, bro. Tea, man. <laughs> bro, I just went, got a tea out my bag. Said this is this is fresh in my laundry from here. All right. I couldn't. It's got to be better than this, it, bro. Yeah, I feel that. To a point where I'm spraying. You know those hotels where you're spraying soap onto mm-hmm. your hand and the soap is dissolving in your hand. Yeah, yeah. Like, what is this? <laughs> the water's just fucking knocking. <laughs> <laughs> like, dog. Let my soap be somewhat dense. <laughs> rubbing yourself with water. <laughs> my soap here, I'm just, I'm just ah, come here. Bubbles. <laughs> yeah, you turn a so, bubble man. <laughs> Dog, I'm like, yo, fucking. <laughs> <laughs> He's got to go like this fast. <laughs> bro, I'm fucking squeezing against my fucking stomach. I'm like, dog, this is like no bubbles, bro. I'm like, <laughs> bubbles? <laughs> I might even wash. I'm just washing myself with dirt, bro. If I had an IV light, it's just fucking mixing in dirt with fucking a little bit of suds, dog. Got your shoulder dirt with your belly dirt. <laughs> oh my god, bro. Damn, so, yeah, man. I thought that was that was that was another trip. Bro. Nah, that's real. But uh, yeah, sir, you don't you, know, you never know what goes down in Vegas, man. Yeah, that's He's got that vibe. Yeah, bro. no, Vegas is like the one place where. And no, not to niggas that live there. Cause I'm like, talking about downtown vet. You school, know where I'm at when area, I go to Vegas. Yeah, so I'm yeah. not going to yeah. You did. Bruh. I get that. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, it's an attraction I, for dirt balls. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, so I've heard. This yeah. is where dirt balls cut loose. Yeah. So Don't. you know where you're at, bro. I'm yeah. like, oh, no, that's where you can't trust. There's any time out there. Yeah. You can you could do you could be anything you want in Vegas. You can do anything <laughs> you want in Vegas. You know what I'm saying? That type of freedom is just like I'm seeing. I'm I'm walking place a bit. <laughs> and it's already hard enough, bro. Really? I can't, bro. I sign up for this app. I can't even start doing what I got to do. I got to go downstairs. Got to give them my license. I got to say, it's me. Sign me up. MGM got a geofence. Yeah. So you can't really? fuck with nothing else on MGM soil. Yeah. You got to go to MGM. So I got to go to them. 
And then when I'm when I get there and they activate it, there's a nigga there waiting with a clipboard saying, "Look, if you deposit more than what two hundred, two hundred, two hundred, you get twenty dollars in free drinks." I'm like, bro, I thought drinks were free. Mm. If drinks are free in the casino, you just go drink. They give you free really? soda. Really? Yeah, they're like staying, nigga. Bro, they're doing shoulder rubs at these gambling tables. Really? But they're like, yo, stay, 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 stay. You got your neck. We got your neck. Bro, <laughs> got it, your neck. bro like, it's crazy. <laughs> when, I was, when I was walking around that mug, and I'm already doing a lot to place a bet, but I'm like, this is how I'm just going to enjoy my time here. Like, there's a lot of basketball going we on. Need to be. Right. Me, bro. Mm-hmm. First Super Bowl, you know what I'm saying? So I'm trying, I got plays to make. Mm-hmm. And we just walking amongst people that are like smoking cigarettes, fucking holding their fucking. <laughs> yeah, you can tell who's losing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You can tell who's not winning 250,000. Yeah, <laughs> fucking foot knees back and shit. Fucking chin. I never seen a nigga's chin on a poker table. <laughs> I seen it, bro. <laughs> just praying and wishing. <laughs> it's not, and bro, just I'm like, I, you see the type of characters that are there. Yeah, dog, Sheldon. I promise you, we land, and nigga, we land, and we're trying to get our bags. We got our bags down, and I'm looking to the left in the direction we're walking. A guy's backing up, holding the camera. Yeah, you good. <laughs> Other side of the camera. Yo, we in Vegas. You already know what the fuck going on, man. We buying bottles. We fucking bitches. We eating good. Cut. Yeah, that's lit, bro. That's what we're here for. Why yeah. we just walking by like that? Like, yeah. Word that's, for word. That's Vegas. Yeah. That's what he's there for. Yeah. I just shake my hands and oh my God. Fast forward, we're trying to find somewhere walking through a hotel. Nigga said, bro, I don't flew way too motherfucking far to be eating a motherfucking cheeseburger. <laughs> I look at him, I said, bro, I'm, I'm like, like, I feel him, too. <laughs> so I ain't come out of the Vegas eat a motherfucking cheeseburger. <laughs> He's telling the whole group. Yeah. <laughs> Walking up the door, so they're going from us steak or something like that. But I'm like, bro, like, th- these are the type of things that are in Vegas. Yeah. That's Surrounded by a man, it's just like, yo, it's, I just don't belong there. Yeah. Sleaze bag, greasy hair, rats. Wow. Fake Cat Williams walking us um, like at the exit of this party saying, Let me get that VIP. <laughs> but uh, wrist man off y'all. That was a greasy hair draw. Oh, he came with yeah. a hat and, and some shades. Like, hey, brothers, you guys, you guys y'all leaving? This white guy, he's like, yeah, Y'all leaving? Y'all using these wristbands? <laughs> but the thing is, you have to fucking, they stamp you first and then give you the wristband. Uh-huh. So there's no way you're going to come in there with a wristband and no stamp. And no stamp, yeah. But I'm trying to tell this guy, he's like, Oh, we'll make it work. We'll make and then it. we're like, All right, let me see if you get it off my wrist. I couldn't get mine off. Tron got his off. Mm-hmm. He gave it a fake Cat Williams. Mm-hmm. I understand not profiling people, but like, nigga, if you give me a chance, bro, I bet I nah. get some. I get, up, I get some right. Yeah, yeah. you see certain characters, man. I'm like, oh, you gotta check this. Guy. I know, yeah, yeah, yeah. check right. this guy out. Check him. Yeah, no. see what he's up to, man. <laughs> nah, man, it's. It's just, I just don't feel safe there, bro. Like, mm-hmm. I generally just don't feel safe. I'm like, niggas yeah. just, it just, yeah, no, nah, man. They're just on a different type of time out there. Word. Gamble 24 7, party till 4 a.m., smoke wherever you want. Damn. It's just, my lungs not set up like that, bro. Yeah. <laughs> I respect my air, bro. Like, it's yeah, not, sometimes I need the air. I need the clean air. Or yeah. As clean as it can get. Bro, really? it's just meant to suck the money out of you, man. Yeah. All right. And once I know something is like, I'm not gonna. I just, I'm not gonna have fun. There. It makes it nasty. It's nasty. You know, it just work, makes bro. it icky. Like, oh no, I don't want that. Bro, the sensor. Yeah. In, in, the, in the fucking snack bar, mm-hmm. it said if you touch it, oh. bro, water is twenty five dollars. Uh. If you touch it, if you touch it, if you, you even fu- it's dusty. I saw it was dusty. Like the condensation from the water is like yeah. going up, and it's all like you know, because no one's fucking with the no shit. One's no one's touching it. Yeah. Eyes were walking away from like checking out. <clears throat> or checking in. Or says, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. If you touch anything on a snap where you're being charged automatically. But I'm just like, bro, I, I put all my shit so far from it. Cause it's just like again, it's just grease ball central, mm-hmm. man. Like <laughs> Yeah, that's crazy. Everyone's slimy just out for a buck, bro. Mm-hmm. Dog, oh my god. So the whole time in Vegas, I didn't even eat. I swear to God. The schedule there is just wild. It just whatever. It didn't make sense. We didn't eat. Mm. I get back to the hotel after Super Bowl. I'm hungry. Niggas got early flight. 4 a.m. We got to be up. Then we got a five-hour or three-hour flight to uh, Vancouver. Five-hour late. Five-hour flight to Toronto. It's going to be a long day. Mm -hmm. I didn't eat at the Super Bowl at all. I just did, like, hot dogs and pizza. Like, you know what I'm saying? That was a good pizza, man. That was a motherfucking... Cloudy. 
Mm. Yep, yep, yep. 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 Puffy <clears throat> pizza, man. Mm. It yeah. was. I get back to the hotel now. I pack. He told me something about about uh, 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 room service mm-hmm. and how like, it was a long way or whatever, whatever. I'm like, all right, let me just figure it out for myself next day. Mm-hmm. So I'm calling. I'm on hold for a minute, bro. Like I'm like, I promise you, I don't even know how long it was. Cause I just had a bitch on speaker. Mm-hmm. Someone finally answers. I was probably on hold for an hour. This is when you fell asleep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And fucking wake up to fucking someone saying hello, hello, Hi. <laughs> bro. So um, they finally answer. They said, "Oh, just before you know anything, like, or order anything, it's a two-hour wait and fucking already room service for a hotel." I was already on hold for a minute, bro. Two-hour wait and. The bare minimum of what we're dropping food off for, you get this, one hundred and twenty dollars oh, for said, one man. I said, no way, ma'am. I said, oh, there's, <laughs> I'm one person. She said, oh yeah, no, that's what you can order drinks and alcohol and like wine and beer. I said, I, don't, I just want I food. Want food. <laughs> she said, I want a burger. Yeah, like, I, just, I literally oh. just want a burger. Oh, <laughs> bro, oh. I was sad, bro. <laughs> that's crazy. Scumbags, bro. Yeah, like, I'm, I said, city. bro, I'm not gonna. Like, if I order $120 worth of food, that's a waste of food. Mm-hmm. I don't want alcohol. Like, I I, I don't drink. Mm-hmm. But I lied. It's, I don't <laughs> drink. Mm-hmm. <laughs> this girl said, well, yeah, I, I don't know. Just on the phone here in dead air. I, like, bro, you don't, on top of it, you don't want to Uber Eats because the fucking roads were packed. Yeah. Your bro, you gotta find this guy cold. in the jungle. Yeah. Oh, my God. Fuck Damn. it, bro. I went to bed. Oh, my gosh. And they got me for the $25 Fiji because I was so thirsty. And I can't wait on room service. Mm. $25. I was about to, man. I was a hair away from grabbing it. That's how 25 I'm like, no, you're not. Mm-hmm. I can't let you do no that to way. me, bro. Yeah, nah, I 20... went downstairs and paid 10 bucks. Okay. <laughs> nah, I, I Better. did. <laughs> but yeah. I did grab it. And I hold on to it like I was like like I stepped on a landmine. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfuckers, bro, it's Damn. not right. I don't like being a sucker. Like Vegas, I feel like I'm a sucker. Like yeah. this is this much. This is this much. You gotta ball out. Chew you wanna come to this, bro? We go to a club and we have like I don't give a fuck about no VIP, no fuck. I don't care about that shit. Mm-hmm. We have a wristband that says we can get drinks all night for free mm-hmm. at a bar. I'm going to a bar to get a drink. Mm-hmm. Where the fuck else am I going to go to a bar? Where the fuck else? That part. We're outside. It's too crowded inside, so we're outside. Mm-hmm. We go to a bar to get a drink. Girl rings us up, comes back. That'll be 70, what is it, $75? $70 USD. $70 USD. Me and him just get a drink. Yeah. I said, oh. <laughs> oh. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> You say how much? I said, like, no, oh no. <laughs> then I turned back around because I think it's good. She's seen my band. Mm-hmm. She said, no, 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 those only work inside. <laughs> uh, well, how many gigs? <laughs> Why? <laughs> how many gigs? Bro, same building. <laughs> Bro, y'all already gambling all over the place while we got put a game right here. <laughs> I play game right here. How many games? <laughs> this is for real. Yo. Oh, man, man. Yo, that's the fucking Las Vegas slogan, man. How many, I mean, games? How many games are you going to play with me? At this time, we're already over it. So, like, he just looks at her. I look at her. I say, but keep, keep it, it, bro. Yeah. Keep Pour it back it in the bottle, bro. bro. It ain't for me, bro. Yeah. We, went to, we went to F1. Same crowded. Same, like, a lot of people. But it's, it's controlled. It's, mm-hmm. You're in a good environment. Yo, you're good here. I said, I don't... I don't got to go nowhere else. I ain't going to wander off. I ain't going... Yeah, I feel that. Lobster? I can go get lobster right there, here, here. Yeah. Fine. Yeah. Oh. Word. That, bro, Vegas, it was just like... <clears throat> I don't know, bro. Yeah. I didn't have a good time. That was the first time I ever took someone else's Uber. <laughs> oh my God, yeah, yeah. That story yeah, tells yeah, itself, yeah, bro. Yeah, like, yo, yeah. I just need to get bro, out. We got yeah. far, bro. We got far, <laughs> bro. We got far. Just rolling, talking, cracking jokes and shit. Yeah. This is you going to the the Hilton? No, we're going to the airport. <laughs> He's like, you, Alex? <laughs> we're like, no, you, Ricardo? He's like, no. no. <laughs> mm. <laughs> <laughs> so, yo, it says you're still picking me up. 
But this one just, this one don't get you chill. I'm chill on my phone. Like we won't get it out. We won't get it out. There was no coming out of that car. I'm chill on my phone. Like this, just start reaching for my strap. So you, who are you, Brian? <laughs> Bro, if I was paranoid about being kidnapped, bro, like I thought niggas was out to get me, yeah. and the nigga said, "You know, Mark." I was like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> "Bro, I was yo." So how did that? How did that end? Like, I'm just like, man, I will throw you a fifty cash, man. Fuck it, just mm. take us to the airport. All right. The thing is, you about to pull up, pull over, and fucking kick us out. Yeah, yeah nah. Yeah. It was five in the morning. This, this is our four a.m. wake up. Mm. And this Uber's already taking long, but niggas are still coming home from parties, so it's mm. still busy out. Mm. And there's a bottom part to the hotel and a top part. We done walked out, bruh, bruh, bruh. 4 a.m. and I didn't eat, mind you. Oh, bruh. Waiting and in mind the lobby. you, waiting in the lobby. Yeah. This nigga comes in, fucking looking like the fucking darkest uh, ball of energy. <laughs> like, I, bro, I can't even, like, he came in literally like the fucking Grove Sisters, the biggest oh, one. Oh, shit, yeah, yeah, just blue. Blue, bro. <laughs> <laughs> he like, came in navy yeah. blue. <laughs> and he was wearing blue. He just walks in and fucking says, hey, bro, I can use a cell phone, bro. Mm. Oh, no, here we go. <laughs> what do we got, man? <laughs> The nigga hits us with a lion, and I'm like, all right, let me just see if the nigga Jen needs help. But you're in a you're in a hotel. You're asking yeah. me to use my phone in a hotel. Yeah, yeah. go ask the front desk. Bro, yeah, there's a line of phones. Yeah, nigga said, bro, I just all right, my phone dead. I just been walking for two days, bro. <laughs> bro, two days? Yeah, man. <laughs> He was walking for two days. Bro, I couldn't help but look at his shoes. So let me see them two days. <laughs> Boy, see what you was stepping in on two days. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, Jordan's a not see two days. Bro, anyways, I'm already waiting for Uber upstairs. This nigga comes asking for to use our phone. Tells us he's been walking for two days. We like, we're, I had to lie. I'm like, yeah, Uber's here. So we go down like prematurely. But now it's like, it's time to get up. I don't want this nigga to come back downstairs and see that we live. Mm-hmm. Time, I'm just scared of this nigga. Bro, this guy's asking to use my phone. I'm putting my phone in my pocket. That's mm-hmm. he's asking. <laughs> like, oh, yeah, yeah. No, yeah, so. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, two days. Two days. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> And I just like, bro. Way too many people are getting scammed these days, bro. You make one call, you have my number. You, yeah. I don't know who you're calling, bro. I don't know what yeah. you're connecting it to. Nah, nigga. Like, yeah. and you haven't been walking for two days. I can't even see this nigga's pupils. Bro, he had his hand in his pants. <laughs> He's like, I don't even gotta touch it for real. Like, I know how niggas be. <laughs> hand on his dick. I'm like, dog, what is happening? I said, yeah, bro. I'll ride here, bro. So. <laughs> we go down and then now this Uber's taking long and it's like four in the morning and one time in Orlando I was trying to leave mm-hmm. and someone accepted my Uber ride from within their house. So they're still getting ready, their whip is just spinning in a house and what the oh, fuck what is the first fuck? doing, bro? <laughs> <laughs> fucking five AM I gotta go to the driver <laughs> spinning. So I'm like So I thought that may have been what was happening. So this guy's just taking long, so by the time he pulls up, it's the same exact car. Mm-hmm. And the plates are only on the back in Vegas. Like, they're not on the front. On Ontario, mm. you got to have them on the front. It's a, it's our law. But in the States, you don't have to. Right. American niggas be putting their plate, nigga, on their sunroof, facing <laughs> up. Bro, like, it's, the niggas don't care over there. Yeah. So there's only a plate on the back. So by the time we get to the back, cuz pop the trunk. Plates in the sky now. Oh, but you said the okay. nigga name. And then I said the nigga's name. I said, you Mark? Uh-huh. And he said, something left his mouth. Uh-huh. <laughs> Almost like that. <laughs> <laughs> took it as a yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Nigga said, yo. <laughs> we, you got to understand, it's a connecting flight. We just mm-hmm. want to get home, bro. I don't care. Yeah. Take me. And I have to check in my bag. I don't know how many people are flying there in Canada. Right. Like, I, I'm getting kind of shaky with my bag. Being checked at a certain time. Take me. And then when he picked us up, it was funny. He was like, um, uh, you from Indiana? I went, nah. He's like, huh. Someone keeps calling me from Indiana, <laughs> man. But sometimes Uber connects you to the most, like, quickest router or whatever. Like, so your number will change to say where it's calling you from. Oh. That we're like, ha, ha, you right, you right, you right. Yeah. But right. it didn't for us then. And then when he said, y'all going to the Hilton? No. Nope. <laughs> Airport. <laughs> I was at the park with my dog, throwing the old tennis ball around. Ready? Wow. 
embarrassing. When I got an alert on my phone from Rocket Money that Apple was increasing their subscription price. I wasn't having that. With a few taps from that alert, I was no longer subscribed and that $10.99 stayed in my pocket. That's the beauty of Rocket Money. Rocket Money is a personal finance app that finds and cancels your unwanted subscriptions, monitors your spending, and helps you lower your bills all in one place. With the Rocket Money app, I can see all of my subscriptions in one place. And if I see something I don't want, I can cancel with a tap. I don't have to log in anywhere or call customer service. Rocket Money does it all for me. Rocket Money has over 5 million users and has helped its members save an average of $720 a year with over 500 million in canceled subscriptions. So stop wasting money on things you don't use. Cancel your unwanted subscriptions by going to rocketmoney.com slash random order. So yeah. like that strip, like you see on the movies and shit, it's really just like that. Yeah. yeah. Like I always see. Like, I think I think it was Rush Hour. We were driving yeah, like all lit up and yeah. shit. Yeah, and, bro, and it's it like was, a giant amusement park, bro. Yeah, it's just yeah, yeah. dopamine everywhere. It's just, mm-hmm. just God, hot, but, horny girls, fucking so, five clubs in a row. Like Super Bowl aside, did you? Is that your first time going to Vegas? Nah, we went a few times. Okay. But even when we went when we were younger, we're like yo, ah, Vegas, yeah, and we're there, we're like, mm-hmm. like ah, oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Okay. Mm-hmm. Say less. Say yeah. Less. yeah. It wasn't it wasn't really it wasn't really doing it for us. We weren't never really really into like uh the gambling scene anyway for real. Yeah. Yeah. Sitting at a poker table and shit. Mm-hmm. No. Hot horny girls, man, we're good. Yeah, cigarettes and shit. Like <clears throat> I if I could smoke weed in there, I'll probably yeah, we chill. I'll be chilling. I, I, at most, I'll sit down and watch a game while I smoke a spliff right there. Like, yeah. That'd be sick. Maybe get some wings. Yeah, like, like you know what I mean? Wings, like, I'm fine with that, bro. Like, I'm totally fine with that. But it's just like, I don't know, man. It's just, it's just, and I don't know if we pay attention to niggas too much. Because, like, honestly, we're very over aware people. Like, mm-hmm. we're very much, without even trying, listening in on different conversations. Like, we're very aware of, like, the yeah. shit. People are saying, like, the cheeseburger comment. He literally said that while walking by me, opening the door, leaving. So that's like a two second interaction. Mm-hmm. I, I come all the way to Vegas from motherfucking cheeseburger, mm-hmm. but it's funny to me it stands out. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> so certain things, it's like, where's I going with this? <laughs> you can't be behind so, oh, Vegas. <laughs> oh, yeah, no. Certain things, just in like being in that atmosphere, niggas are saying some crazy shit, or you're you're overhearing some like. Or you're seeing a really old man with a younger woman that you're just like, all right, bro, I don't want. I don't know where your life at, bro. Mm-hmm. I, don't know where, I don't know where she at, bro. Mm-hmm. I don't know what you doing, bro. Mm-hmm. But I'm. It just doesn't feel good. It feels bad energy. Very bad yeah. energy yeah. there. Like, yeah. but I'm sure you can go there and be sorted at the Caesar's Palace. And it's a little bit better energy over there. Yeah. Like, or not? Maybe it's even Maybe richer it's and darker the same people. Shit like, everywhere. Damn. Mm-hmm. But it's just it's just not for me, man. Like, Word. that's my yeah. piece. It's pretty small too. Yeah. We got really? a car there one time. We're like, I right, let's drive a strip, man. Mm-hmm. Just, mm-hmm. Oh shit. Got a U-turn and shit. <laughs> <laughs> it's an interesting place, yeah. man. Yeah, the gambling district and shit. Mm-hmm. I never, yeah. we never really drove out and seen houses and shit. But yeah, I'm wondering like what, like, I guess the outer skirts of Vegas look like. I feel like it looks like Phoenix. I don't know why. Yeah, yeah, it's desert. Okay, so that makes sense. Yeah, sweet real estate. Cold though, it was cold as fuck. Yeah, it dips, man. Yeah, Same temperature, bro. I packed my coat, fucking took it out. <clears throat> really? Mm-hmm. Damn, they would get me, man, because I would think we just gonna be hot. Yeah, all, all shorts. The time, oh. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, like Orlando. Yeah. We had this bowling event uh, for NFL, and we met the funniest fucking person. Her name is Riches. She makes music. Yeah. We met the funniest person. She came up to Not us. Then. Yeah, shot the Riches man. She came out to us and offered us a cucumber smoothie salad drink. And it was just the funniest thing. Like, for someone that watches us and then for someone to meet us and then, like, like the universe just set it up for, like, her. she had one. There's two of us there and she has one cucumber. Like, just the, the most awkward thing to hand someone is like, I want a cucumber drink. <laughs> what, what is this? <laughs> That's the reaction you're gonna get. Like, it's just that random. But she had to say like what it is and shit. But she just stand there with her cucumber drinks. Like, None of us are touching. Her, like, you want it? <laughs> <laughs> you want? It? I don't know what it is. <laughs> She's like, I, I, well, I just want to let y'all know I'm so nervous. Not been, <laughs> been wondering. That, like, for ten minutes, how I'm gonna come over here and ask y'all if y'all want this drink? So just try it. <laughs> he tries it. He likes it. I try it. I hate it. Mm-hmm. 
But we just had a funny conversation after that, like mm, nice. for probably about like ten minutes chopping it up, just whatever, going back and forth. But I say, yo, she's ever in Orlando or wherever in Vegas, we gotta have her on the podcast. Really? Yeah. She was funny, yeah. bro. Yeah. Nice. She makes music. I definitely told her I'd check out her song and I, I listened to it. So if you're watching this, I loved it. Nice. But uh, her name is Riches. Riches. Um, like, Riches. Just rich. Yes. How yeah. you again? I'll tell you because R I T C H E S S. Oh, and her that, song that part. is called For You. Go and stream that. But yeah, man, I'd love to have her on the podcast. She was so full of energy, man. Amen, so man. Fit right into the community, man. Speaking of which, we going to yeah. dip our chubby <laughs> fingers into the Discord, man. We tapped in with Mr. Big Body Biz. He sent a two piece. Hey, guys. Long time fan. Uh, one question here. Which beat comes in harder? The beat from Uptown with Drake or the beat uh, This Is How We Do, 50 Cent? This is how we do uh, Shout out from Chicago. Peace. Yeah, shout out to the C, shout man. The, the C, answer man. is how we do, yeah, man. Definitely. I wasn't, even, I wasn't even ready for that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that shit just man. hit you in the head. Yeah. <laughs> you never know if the clap is going to end and just. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. like a soccer yeah. ball just hit you. Oh, yeah. I Yo, know. who produced that? It had Dre. to be Dre on the keys, man. That was Dre? I'm not even sure. I don't know. I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I had to I be put Dre. my money on that. I bet on that. Mm-hmm. For niggas say I put Lamborghini doors on the Escalade, it has to be Dre. And he did. Mm. And he did. And then I did it in, in fucking Need for No. Yeah. Oh, man. Dre. Yeah. What was the game? What was the Blank on the game. Lamborghini doors? Yeah. Midnight Club. Midnight Club, Midnight Club yeah. yeah. Bang on there. Yeah. Not a, and Uptown, Bro, it hit hard, but you got to understand, like, that it came don't in really as a. It hit hard. It do. Like when it nah, it, it don't do. really hit it come hard. In. It do. Yeah, no, do it. Hit. It do it. That bitch <laughs> not, nah, bro. It's nah. just more of an R and B song, so it's like that's the like, one with Bub B, right? Yeah. Nah, yeah. I can't say that hit, bro. Bro, you ever listen to it with some bass? I'm How do does it, it come in? Just, as soon as you press play, it's <laughs> yeah, just as soon as you press play. But <laughs> I remember that in Crisis Three Hundred. I feel like I feel like the, the kick is not like it's not really like a bass behind. Yeah, the not, kick like how if I not like how we do. Not like how we. But like that's what I'm saying. How we do more hip hop. For sure. Yeah. For and, sure. and like Uptown had more R and B essence. Like it wasn't really R and B song, but it was like slower pace and all it was that very shit. Slow, you know? yeah, very, very slow. Very slow. Yeah. But yeah. Again, and again, when the niggas talking about Lamborghini dogs on the Escalade, like, you yeah, feel yeah, me? Yeah, Bro, yeah. there's just I was just yeah, introduced yeah. to so much. That was an intro to the game himself. Yeah. New yeah. member of June that unlocked. It is how you coming. Fire. This is the first time I seen Fifty Cent in a fucking <laughs> Escalade with Lamborghini doors. Mm-hmm. Like what? With spinners. Poof. Bro, the amount of physics involved <laughs> it just fucking blew my mind. Things are bro. going opposite ways. And, and it's yeah. Fifty Cent. He Let's was be real. The biggest, like, and at, then the flow at the end. Oh man. Yeah. Oh my god. Keep me. <laughs> 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 I did anything you want, yeah. girl. <laughs> you know I'm fucking with the best. Oh man. <laughs> that, 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 that's a good question, man. Good what's, the, what's 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 on yeah. the other? What are you guys doing another meet and greet? Chicago, Minneapolis, and Milwaukee. What's up? Even Orlando. What did he say? Yeah. When we do another meet and greet. Oh, man. Man, meet- random order live, Yo. man. Yeah. Yeah. That, 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 that part, part man. That yeah. part. Yeah. Random yeah. order in human form, man. Yeah. yeah. We coming at you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that'll be the next mm-hmm. the next thing we believe in. Meet yeah. greet and chill, man. Give me another one, man. <clears throat> what are you about to say? Hmm? You mm-hmm. about to say something? Another what question? Yeah. Oh, I was gonna say we also we're probably gonna be linked up with my boy Waleed. His food truck business, Waleed the kebab mean. cart going up, mm-hmm. pop up in Toronto. Yeah, he man. did his first public mm-hmm. kebab event. Look crazy, people came out and supported him, man. Yeah, salute to that so, bro. Yeah, mm-hmm. so we'll definitely be a part of the next one. Yeah, sure. hang out there. <clears throat> that that part. Yeah, eat some good rap. Sleep, man. We got Jamizi. Oh man, my nigga. Oh, that my dog. Yeah, my nigga, bro. You know Jamizi. Go ahead. Oh, where's the eagle sound? Yeah, Jamizi. Yeah. Yo, what are you saying? It's Jamizi from Brampton. Still flying in, always supporting. Um, I got a would you rather question for y'all. So, would you rather never watch a movie or TV show ever again? or mm. never listen to music ever again. Uh, but music in movies 
or TV shows count because that's part of the um, the, the watching experience. Okay. But you're never allowed to, to listen to music ever again, like radio, streaming, CDs, none of that. Or you're never allowed to, to yeah, watch TV, watch um, any movie or TV on a screen ever again. Mm. Um, that one got me stuck, can't even lie. Um, I still don't know what I would choose. I'd probably choose like never watch movies again because music just means too much to me yeah yeah um but i want to know your thoughts yeah that's my instinct too that's my instinct keep music yeah Yeah, that's tough music yeah that's tough though for real yeah only because you can play music and talk can't really you don't really watch movie and talk like i don't i it i don't i get upset when people watch movie and like i'm putting on a movie to be social yeah that's why they (laughs) put on a movie and talk you know that's why they say going to the movies isn't a good first date or whatever yeah yeah. where it's like you can go yeah i yeah you just yeah you just you blew that wide open brother yeah my yeah yeah, i'm I'm used to that they showed it that's it right there yeah i'm i'm going music man Mm because even like bro I catch a ball, boy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I want to fucking my, dance the fucking <laughs> Leonardo DiCaprio being stabbed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. It's going to be anybody in beer, bro. You know, yeah. Yeah, nah, 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 yeah. yeah. Definitely, yeah. definitely, definitely, yeah. Music. That's it, yeah. yeah. Yeah, music. For sure. Yeah. Appreciate it, bro. That, that part. Mm. All day. Yeah. Hey, before we get up out of here. <laughs> I didn't even, I, even do that. That was kind of fire, though. <laughs> the fucking I didn't have a Come and get one of these Last week Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah 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 It's not too crazy It's not too crazy It's not too crazy Give you some Give some Nigga Tim Hortons No way We have beef with him right now Do you? Yeah Well damn nigga This drink might It might squash, squash the, beef. the beef Let me hear it Blackberry Yuzu Quencher Black You always on a new berry or something Bro Blackberry Yuzu Quencher, I'm telling you. Blackberry Yuzu? Blackberry Yuzu Quencher from Tim Hortons. Blackberry Yuzu? Yeah, why Oh, why Yuzu? Why Yuzu? Yeah. Bruh. A lightly bubbly, refreshing, fruity taste at Tim's. I'm telling you. It's bro. fizzy? It's fizzy. It looks refreshing. Okay. Yeah. Try it. Go so get one of them. How'd you stumble yeah. on you? My shawty, man. Y'all better, y'all, better, y'all better come up here and get one yeah, of these. Man, salute, man. <laughs> yeah, man. Salute. Yeah, man. Salute. Yeah, man. Zara be on it, man. She be on her. She she pretty much get like quenchers and refreshers mm-hmm. like pretty much wherever we go. Keep like, it light. Like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? So, she not on the coffee bean? Mm. She she can't do coffee with her stomach and shit. Mm. She got IBS, so she respect. can't Respect. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, respect. So, no uh, peanuts. No, no, no coffee. No peanuts, no coffee. I'm off coffee too now, man. Off. Officially, yeah. We, we was off of it until we came here and we started working on the show. And then I was back it, on yeah. it, like, yeah. To, yeah. I wouldn't say needed it, mm-hmm. but it just, it definitely gave you a, it gives you that boost that you need. I miss it for sure. I miss it when you're on yeah. a constant basis. Basic when you go on a constant flow mm-hmm. and you're working like if like if we grind something out every morning and doing the same thing every morning, mm-hmm. I see when it it, it makes sense. Mm. But like when, but wouldn't your body just adapt to that? It would. Yeah, you could. But sometimes you have to. The the variables where you're like, all right, tonight I have an extra late night, then so mm-hmm. I gotta compensate for oh, the for night the, before. In the morning don't yeah. change. Yeah. I was finding that when I was doing like back to back to back to back, mm-hmm. then it like it started to I didn't like how I felt. Mm-hmm. So I just made it about all right, when do I really like mm-hmm. I need a little pickup. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And then when I truly yeah. don't need it, I'm gonna I'm gonna try my best to stay away. But yeah. 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 I appreciate a good bean, man. Just Bro. double espresso over ice. Man. Appreciate the bean. Like I actually started to like <laughs> Not even, I always, no, I would say I started to really like the taste of coffee too. Like yeah, that's even, where I'm at. It wasn't even just how it made me feel, mm. it was the taste. Yeah. So much so that I have this like caffeine free instant coffee at my house because I just like the taste so much. Is that what, is that what decaf is? It's less. Probably. It's half. I think it's half of the caffeine. It's less caffeine. Oh, okay. okay I don't okay, think okay, it's just okay, no, fair. I don't think it's just no caffeine. I could be wrong though. Yeah. You know, sign off in the comments, but yeah, literally mm. caffeine free. It's this thing called Inca. Caffeine free instant coffee, and I just drink that to feel something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can hear that, man. That's yeah. fair. Bam, bam, bam. Yeah. yeah, I don't know, man. Fuck. Uh, it just yeah. comes to a point where it's just like I wake up, I'm like, it's routine. I need it. Mm-hmm. Like, <laughs> and not even like, 
No, nah, man, because then I could argue with myself that I can do the reverse. Because I feel like mentally sometimes it just gives me more energy than actual beans giving me. Right. Like mentally, I know I drank coffee, so like I should have like more energy. Oh, oh like a placebo. It, yeah, damn. So it's like you know, but then I'm saying I can't make the argument of like I didn't have a coffee. I don't need. I can so get tired. energy off that. But like oh. I, that's why I do lean into that. Like yeah. I need a coffee. I I'm need so a coffee. Tired I'm so tired. It, yeah. But like. That's why I'd rather happen in the morning. I had it. Like, I don't have to think about it. Mm -hmm. But, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it also stains it's staining my teeth, man. Big time, yeah. yeah Me too. I don't want to get them waiting, too. man. Me too. But I have yeah. a month left of the Invisalign. Nice. And then oh, I'm damn. Gonna probably get my shit whitened up and then. Yeah. Damn, teeth I'll be done. Straight. Yeah, teeth are almost done, man. Yeah. Fuck, nice. Yeah, then you man. have to wear it for life, man. That's, that's where it got yeah. me. Well, it's just at night, right? I hated that. I'm okay with that. Understand? No, well, they wanted to stretch my fucking program. Like I had yeah. a month left, and they're like, "Oh yeah, six more months, man, bro." I, I, that might happen for me too. Hey, I didn't like that. That might happen for me too. They yeah. get you with the for life uh, retainer. Yeah, the for life retainer. But my, it, mm -hmm. that wasn't it for me. It was definitely they wanted me to do like thirty more trades, and I was like, "Bro, that's yeah, a whole that's year, a lot, bro. man." But 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 at the same time, bro, I'm very happy with. The results. My results. Yeah. So if I could get even more, like yeah. if they if they come to me and they like six more, I'll do it. I'm yeah. not gonna be paying for it too, so I'm, yeah. I'll do yeah. it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. No, nah, I'm hoping honest, not. At the time, I should have done it, man. It was it was. Yeah. But that's when we started to eat we, good and shit. Yeah, we're starting to eat good. We're starting to travel, so now it was like harder because I was it's missing trays. Yeah. So I'm I'm having two trays a day. Then like now when I'm going back, I was too far in and mm -hmm. fucking, it, honestly, it's going to sound like a bunch of excuses because at any point I could have had it in, but yeah. I just, I had them for yeah, four like, years, bro. Work, man. You got to make it work. Yeah, that's a long time, bro. Four years lie. is a long time, bro. My teeth are four bad. Years? That's how long we had them for. I said, we. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I had them just from 20, I got them 2014. Damn. 2014, man. 2015, 16, 17, 18, and then 19 is like when I really <laughs> stopped. Fuck. Damn. That's five years. Yeah, that's a long So you're telling me at the end of four years, you want me to go another year? Yeah. I yeah, wasn't I was having it, bro. <laughs> and then they started adding my attachments, telling me rubber bands. But this is yeah. when Invisalign first got to Canada. Mm. So we didn't even have this technology. So mm. I'm sending this shit to, like, LA. Lab, yeah. To then dump send it back. Like, bro, it took, like, eight weeks from to get my first trace. Mm-hmm. I said that's difficult. Yeah. yeah, I went back to get the, the a tray for my tooth. Mm -hmm. So I now have a tray on. You, you did. Oh. You see what I'm saying? You didn't even notice. Nah, I didn't even notice. But they did this in a week. So yeah. if it was this quick and I'm getting yeah. my shit here and they can send my shit here, fine. But mm -hmm. back in the day, it was like, bro, you got to come to Brampton. We got to do a checkup. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, they added these new attachments. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> Fucking wear elastics. <laughs> if it's like I didn't that, understand that, bro. Gate. The elastics were this big. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and like, I, I I'm like, how the fuck does it mm -hmm. stretch? It didn't even seem like it could get stretched yeah, to the did. other tooth, much less fucking yeah. let this nigga talk. Yeah. But they really, they really work, though. Like, they do. They do. Like, they my, do. Like, I got a little bite now. I never used to have no bite. Yeah. My shit used yeah. to just be like this. Yeah. You know, now I got a little, a little bit of, yeah. of a bite. So it really worked, but it shit is annoying, man, for sure. They just kept dropping new shit on me, and mm -hmm. I was already it, four it was years. Very early. Like, like, that is, yeah. It was so early, even bro. even when I went to do my shits and they they did the little scan, I was like, oh shit! Like yeah. I, I was expecting to do like the grill, like you yeah. bite down the thing, and they don't even do the molds no more. They just they really, just scan you. They just three D scan your teeth. Yeah, and then they send well, it yeah. and your jaw and shit, and that's it. So you got your like, props open. Yeah, it's like a little. It's 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 like something like this, and mm -hmm. it just goes in your mouth, and they just mm -hmm. put it oh, you that's know, crazy. all yeah. through your mouth and take all the pictures, and then take they literally earrings, show you man, right shit. there how yeah. it's gonna shift and shit and. Yeah. That's wild. Come a long way still. Yeah, respect. Yeah. Does whitening your teeth yeah. hurt? What's the deal with that? I don't know. I need to find the best way. I think it could get teeth. sensitive, but I don't know if it could hurt, though. Yeah. I don't, yeah, I think it's sensitive. It's well, there's certain programs that, like, it's like a teeth gel that like, you put on and you keep mm -hmm. and then you take off. Like, there's certain things, but, like. you get zap. That's how you yeah. get zap, All that gel shit, yeah, bro. That shit is zap, you. Woo. Yeah. Yeah, I, I don't know, man. It's 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 always best to go to the dentist, but that's what they gave you. But yeah. with insurance, they don't because you can go for a white and then you'll be blessed. But yeah, I need to get some yeah. insurance. Yeah, but grown insurance, top, yeah. man. Mm -hmm. grown top. Yeah. Man. Speaking of grown yeah. top, man, and getting aligned, bro. I don't know how this is physically possible. Yo, why my man driving sideways, bro? <laughs> 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 What's going on? My man, right there. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo, you drifted down. 
out. <laughs> How's he sideways? He's doing the crab walk, hey, bro. Yeah. <laughs> What's up with old boy going sideways? Bro, that threw me off. Bro, he's, no, that was right. <laughs> bro, he's fully sideways. He's fully sideways, yes. bro. <laughs> I'm on the boulevard. I ain't trying to get no more tickets. That is crazy. <laughs> Oh boy. Yeah, he's nah, doing a crab walk. You can't do that. You can't run that, bro. <laughs> you guys know what a crab walk is with Jeeps? Yeah, 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 yeah. That's yeah. what I want. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, this is crazy. <laughs> I wonder if he's turned side yeah. or if he's Yeah, like if he's so in the whip like this. Mario Kart. <laughs> Mario Kart. <laughs> yeah. Dog. Get over it. <laughs> 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 Bro, I'm switching lanes to the last. Slide away, slide over it. Nah. <laughs> nah, they got an interview. Yeah. Like, you know, they got to figure this out, man. What's the project, bro? What's the vision? My man driving sideways, man. What's going on with my man right now? Yeah. <laughs> bro, you slot. Hey, yo, you <laughs> Bro, how did your car not split in half, bro? Yo, what's up with old boy? Hey, yo! What's up with old boy? Yo. yo. Nah, that's different. Oh, my God. Duh. Oh, my God. <laughs> It's so funny that he loses every time he sees the nigga yeah. turn. He's the only I gotta get him. It speeds up. I'm going to the because I'm on the boulevard. I ain't trying to get no more tickets. Yo. What's going on with old boy, though? Doug. Nah. He knows he's being recorded. Nah. He's like trying to like skate away. Nah. I need to know if they ever talk to this guy, bro. I need to. Yeah, I need to look that up. <laughs> Somebody explain, yeah. Ray. Yeah, please. please. <laughs> My nigga got a tear out of his eye. Yeah. I'm crying, bro. <laughs> that's oh, that's how old is this yeah, man? That's 40 as fuck. Oh, it's my fucking God. Dog. Crooked Think, tires, man. The things people could do with their cars, bro. <laughs> bro, I, that's just a new form of physics unlocked, bro. I didn't know that was possible. Yeah, yeah. Nah, that's different. I don't even know if he was trying to do that or if it just happened. He's like, bro, I got. I just gotta get home, man. I gotta <laughs> go, bro. I'm just trying to I make it. Go, bro. Bro. Just trying to make it. This thing is blind spot is diagonal. Hey, check. <laughs> you know this. Check the corner of the car, bro. <laughs> You see his body. You already looking yeah. at it already. You already looking at it. It's all good. <laughs> yeah, bro. Oh, that was man. different, man. Dog, how's your car not spinning? Yeah, Get home no. safe, man. Fuck, fuck, yeah. Man. Oh, man. All day. Yeah. Man. 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 I'm going to go get a boo bag, boo 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 yeah. yeah, you already know what it is, man. What a wholesome episode this has been, man. Y'all know what y'all need to do, man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Go on, hit the boop with the boops, man. Jump on the keyboards, man. Hit all the good buttons, man. We like a good reviewer too. Come on. Apple Music, Spotify. Man, we out here, man. Get active in the yeah. in the in the yamins. For sure. <laughs> hit the Discord, man. Tap in with us, man. <laughs> Amen. We leaving them with anything? Um Nah, man, Office Movers coming soon, man. I think I'm going to say that every day until the bitch drop, man. <laughs> Real nice. deal. Nice. Yeah. 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 Fuck with us in Discord, man. Ain't, ain't nothing yeah, going on, but everything going on, man. Nah, I can't, man. Hit that QR code. Yeah. 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 I better come up here and get one of these. Amen. Yeah. Hey. Hey. Me. Man, I was like, fuck. <laughs> I'm <laughs> punching the stomach during the amen. Amen. <laughs> 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 <laughs>